Hi everyone, and yeah, welcome to my preview for the Australian Grand Prix at Albert Park. Uh, an event that's really grown for V8 supercars since that year in 07 when we weren't on the bill. Since then, uh, we've certainly been looked after uh, a new level. We've got our own pit lane, therefore we can have pit stops in the races. Uh, all under Channel 10's banner this year, which certainly makes life a lot easier for everyone, particularly on the television side of things. Um, but listen, it's always been a non-championship event. People say they don't try. Uh, that's absolute rubbish. Any racing driver that goes into a race, on survivor goes down, the competitive instinct you know, takes over and, and we race as hard as we can. Having said that, it gives you the freedom to often try things you wouldn't otherwise try at a normal uh, championship round because if it does go wrong, you know, you don't lose any points. So uh, we often, when we say use it as a test session, we, we try a few more radical things on the car than otherwise, than you otherwise would. And um, you can learn a lot because it's your standard street track where it's incredibly slippery on Thursday. And by the time we get to our final race on Sunday morning, the track's got a massive amount of rubber from all the Formula Ones. And uh, it really, you, you learn how to evolve your car over the four days. So I love the circuit. I've never actually won there. I think I've had plenty of podiums there over the years, probably five or six times. Um, and I just love racing uh, in front of a different sort of crowd than we, our normal V8 events. We get our die-hard fans there, but we've got all the Formula One fans and corporates, and, and we put on a great show for, for, for everyone, there's no doubt about that. So uh, can't wait to get back there this year um, and put on a great show in a, in a less stress environment. And uh, yeah, it'd be great to uh, improve on what was a great result for me there last year with Erebus. I think we were around the top five, so um, yeah, it'd be great to spray some champagne on the Formula 1 podium is always a big highlight.